Hey guys, I just wanted to share something with you um, that happened to me earlier today. Now, you might recognise some of this room so from the videos. Um, I spend quite a lot of time in this room. I sit at this desk. We've kind of changed the spare room um, into a, st a study for me, so I can just sit here and do some work. And so I sit here, I sit on my laptop, I get on with some work. Um, I use the uh, little bed behind for a little prayer nap every now and then. Um, I'm really close to my guitar, so I can just sit and play a little tune. Um, whenever I want to. Um, I've got all my books on the bookshelf all the way around the top. Um, and it's great, I love it in here. There's good natural light, I can see out the window. Like, I quite like being in here. Um, but earlier something happened to me um, that hadn't really happened during lockdown, or at least I hadn't recognised it during the time. Um, and that is that I felt really lonely. For one moment, um, just for like a little bit of time, I felt really, really alone. Um, and I shouldn't have really, because I was just uh, a few minutes before um, in a Zoom chat with some of the Grey Friars team, so we had some of the kind of ministry leaders all catching up and sharing ideas and praying for each other and things like that. And so I was in this kind of Zoom chat um, with like six or seven others, and the room was like full of conversation and friends and voices I recognised. Um, and then you know, it was time to finish, we had to move on, um, that was the end of that meeting, and so we just clicked leave meeting, um, and the whole thing was finished. And it was at that point that I realised um, that, like, it was deadly silent. There was no noise, and I was all alone, and I felt really lonely for the first time throughout all of lockdown. And it wasn't because I'm alone, um, it was just because I'd been with loads of people but then suddenly, um, it all gone. It just shut down completely, and I was like, "Man, I feel like in this in this quiet right now, um, I feel really alone." And it's because it happened so quickly, and I sat in that place of like loneliness for about half an hour, and I was like, "What is going on? Why do I feel like this? I've just been with my friends and my colleagues." Um, I've just been trying to kind of work it all out, and so I wanted to encourage you that if you are feeling um, lonely at any point, or uh, struggling with uh, feeling anxiety or things like that, you definitely aren't the only one. Um, lots of us feel like that. Um, and so, I guess, I don't really have any answers for you today, um, but I wanted to read some verses from Isaiah that um, God kind of led me to during that time when I felt really lonely this morning. Um, that just helped encourage me and remind me uh, that he's with me. So it's from Isaiah 43, and I'm going to miss out a few little bits and put a few bits together just to help it make sense. It says, Fear not, for I have redeemed you. I have called you by name. You are mine. When you pass through the waters, I will be with you. When you pass through the rivers, they will not sweep over you. When you walk through the fire, you will not be burned, the flames will not set you ablaze. For I am the Lord your God, the Holy One of Israel, your Saviour. And you are precious and honoured in my sight, and I love you. And you see, so that was just a real encouragement to me. That God sees us through the waters, sees us through the fire, through those times when we struggle, and they will not overcome us because... He is with us. So maybe if you feel a bit like that, jump to Isaiah 43 and just read through some of it because there's some amazing promises in there for when you're feeling low and like everything's just a bit overwhelming. And it really helped me today as I was feeling particularly lonely this morning. So let's pray together. Lord, thank you that you have redeemed us, you have called us by name and that we are yours. And I pray that we would know that we are precious in your sight and that even when we feel alone or anxious um, or whatever it is that we're going through, Lord, would we know that we uh, are loved by you and you are not far away, but you are close, so close. Help us to remember your love in our times when we're feeling low. In Jesus' name. Amen.